Oh, the great blue phoenix, what stories do you have to tell us? A long, long time ago, there was a weak cookie. He was so weak that his own crispy body couldn't hold his crusty state. One day, the weak cookie became sick, very sick. He thought that his life was over. He didn't have anyone close to him. But at one night, a kind witch gave him a potion of immortality. She warned him that if he drinks this potion, he'll never be the same cookie ever again. You'll be feeling a burning spice all over of your body. But the weak cookie didn't listen to her warning. He drank the potion of immortality and felt the burn inside of him. The weak cookie felt more powerful, more beautiful, more hot than ever he could imagine. He became something more than a spices. He now called himself Blue Phoenix Cookie, the Great Blue Phoenix. He began to collect all of the riches, golds, and crystals. He became very greedy. One day, a cookie in gold came to his palace. She asked him if she could get some golds for herself. The great blue phoenix was about to deny her request, but until he noticed something, something more precious than any riches and golds. It was her beautiful golden eyes. He needed that. He needed it. I will give you my riches, golds and crystals, says Blue Phoenix Cookie. In return, you will give me your golden eyes. My eyes, you say, says Cookie in gold. I'm afraid I can't give you my eyes, but I can give you something more precious than my eyes. More precious than your eyes? Which is it? asked Blue Phoenix Cookie. It's my own golden heart, says Cookie in gold. But if you want my heart, you have to earn it. Ha, huh? asked Blue Phoenix Cookie. Simple, you have to stole it by showing around your palace. Blue Phoenix Cookie thought about it for a moment. Then he agreed with her. I will stole your golden heart and you'll be my precious treasure forever.